So we want to go ahead and say happy Valentine's Day to you. Happy Valentine's Day. What's good? Hey everyone. What it do? What's poppin'? Her name is Ebony. His name is Eugene. And today's video is about the importance of self-love. Let's talk about it. So, most of us associate Valentine's Day with loving on someone else, someone else loving on us, doing things for others, with others, and that's a beautiful thing. It's always great to have someone who you can celebrate Valentine's Day with. But we have another way of looking at Valentine's Day. What about those who may not have a Valentine's? Right. How can they celebrate Valentine's and still find joy and happiness on this day? We're going to talk about a few ways that you can love on yourself. A few different ways that you can express self-love to you because we believe that's very important as well. So, what are some ways we can show love to ourselves? So, a few ways that we can show love to ourselves is simply saying loving things to ourselves. Saying, I love you to yourself. Mm -hmm. For example, I love you, Ebony. You're beautiful, Ebony. You're wonderful, Ebony. Just speaking great things about yourself. Things that maybe you would want someone to say to you, but instead you're saying it to yourself. Beautiful. You can write these things down, get yourself a card, look in the mirror, speak it over yourself. There's many different ways that we can go about that. What are some other things that we can do? We can go ahead and give ourselves a hug. Sometimes people don't even give themselves a hug. So it may feel actually wonderful for you to give yourself a hug. And say whatever you want to yourself during that time. And massaging yourself is awesome as well. A lot of times we want someone else to massage us. But you can massage yourself as well. Massages are always awesome. Especially on Valentine's Day. But every day for me personally. But <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, giving yourself a massage. You know, Speaking nice things over yourself. Giving yourself a massage. Hugging yourself. These are some great things to do with yourself. Correct. Another thing you can do as well is take yourself out. It could be food. It could be an activity. Maybe something that you enjoy that you haven't done in a while. Or that you haven't had the opportunity to do for whatever reason. Focusing on what you want to do. Whatever it is that you like to do. Whatever it is that you desire to do. Do it for yourself because you deserve it. You deserve it. You can also buy yourself a gift. So whatever type of gift you want. You know, sometimes people want gifts from other people, but you can buy yourself a gift. Whatever it is that you want. You can also wrap it up. Put your name on it. You can do whatever you want to do because it's for you. Another thing is you don't need to do this just on Valentine's Day. You can do this every day, which is awesome. Very great point so with all those different great things that you can do another reason why we feel it's important to give yourself love because it's hard to give something to others that you don't have yourself so good and so true so even if you do have a valentine that doesn't stop you from loving yourself yes from providing self-love Yes. To yourself. Because that's only going to increase the love that we give to others. So true, you guys. It's important to set that time for yourself every single day. I always say I feel as though that's one of the most important things to do is to give yourself love to yourself. Definitely. It's a beautiful thing. Keep in mind, we're not saying 
Celebrating Valentine's Day the traditional way is bad. It's great. It's a beautiful thing. And it spreads love. Mm -hmm. We're just saying that if you don't have anyone to share Valentine's with, you can still enjoy it. You can. With yourself, for yourself, and by yourself. Yes. And even if you do have a Valentine's, you can still love on yourself. Before, after, and as my wife said, this should and can be a daily thing. Also, a lot of times people focus on like the gifts and the teddy bears and the chocolate, all of these things on Valentine's Day, but the greatest thing is love. And loving yourself is so important. I know sometimes people can be down on Valentine's Day, they can be sad on Valentine's Day, but if you shift your focus and you shift your focus on love and you shift your focus on everything that brings you love and brings you joy, that will help you get through the day and not even just get through the day. You could probably have an amazing day if you just shift your focus and not just on Valentine's Day, but every single day. Very good. So don't focus on what you don't have. Focus on what you do have and provide yourself those things that you want, mm -hmm. if possible. Whenever possible, daily. With that being said, if you feel in the vibe, like and subscribe. And if you ain't, just leave us a lovely thumbs up. That'll work. And we out. Bye.